Another busy day of campaigning for two of the candidates in the race for Mobile Mayor. Sandy Stimson made several stops today in his search for votes. Challenger Sandy Stimson was back on the campaign trail today. We caught up with him at Sage Park at the start of the South Alabama Soccer Association game. I think I got home at 11 o'clock last night. After spending Saturday with supporters at a rally and waves around town, Stimson was out Sunday shaking the hands of prospective voters. And here at Sage Park, the voters say there is something they want from the candidate if he's elected. Bo Metter says more players are injured because of the poor field conditions than the game at Sage Park. Their league wants more help from the city. I've been playing out here for years, and this condition is the fields out here have always been in this condition, and we would just like the, you know, for the fields to be maintained. And Stimson came through with a promise if he wins Tuesday. One of the first priorities that we said was about quality of life. And we say it's the things that we do in our spare time, our recreation, that are important. And people want nice parks, destinations, you know, so when they go there that it's well maintained, it's safe. And so absolutely this is a priority. From the park, Stimson headed to a fundraiser for the battle against melanoma at St. Mary's Catholic Church. The threat of rain didn't stop the event or Stimson's campaigning efforts. The whole focus is really just trying to convince people that, that their vote counts, that it makes a difference. You know, one vote can make a difference. And so when I meet them, you know, if they haven't made up their mind, I try to convince them to vote for me. Uh, if they've made up their mind, I just say, you've got to go vote. Stimson believes a lot of people will turn out to cast their ballots Tuesday. This uh, election is, uh, uh, you know, the, the most interest that we've had in years, you know, maybe 20 years, uh, if not longer than that. Yes, yeah, so I think it'd be a big turnout. Stimson says he plans to go business to business tomorrow, encouraging owners and their employees to get out and vote Tuesday.